Hey everyone, welcome to my first YouTube video. Today I will show you how to install KDE Plasma on Arch Linux. And I normally use Awesome Window Manager. So this is a window tiling manager. But if you're looking for something more feature rich and more user friendly, KDE is a great choice. First of all, you need to update your system. So do sudo pacman minus yu. This will be capital. Yep. And then go ahead and put in the password. And when this is done, you just go and now you, now you start to install the packages. Just do plasma and key. Do all, just do all. Just go ahead and just press enter. I'll come back after this is done. And now that it's all done and downloaded, you might have to if you just have to go log out of your system and then look for a look for an option in the login screen on your display manager to log into the Giddy Palma for those who those of you who don't have a display manager set up yet, you might have to do so like main minus sdm. sdm is the one I would recommend. So to do this, and just I already have sdm, so I'm not gonna install it again. So after that, you you, you will have to do so system cdl enable sdm. And then you have to do so the system system say it starts as a DM so that's it and you just log out of your system or reboot and just let's just reboot okay every so this reboot so right right over here in SDM you will see the display manager that I was using I was using awesome domain so this is plasma with Wayland which we have not installed properly so if you want to use with Wayland I'll, I will, I'll upload a next video if you want that if you let me know and this one this is what we have installed so we use plasma plasma with x11 with x or server so we'll just click this and just log in and people who are using different window manager might have some um, similar but different um, options so just look for it just log in your plasma made by KDE so. so you will be welcome with a welcome screen I don't know what the smallest point I'm using this in a virtual machine so it's giving some kind of error in my mouse but let's just say next, next, next. So basically, this is how you, this is how you install KDE Plasma. So I will. So the next video will be about how to customize KDE Plasma. So if you want that, just stick around and like and subscribe to the channel.